everyone, my name is John from Washington Elites, and this is the premier platform for news and entertainment, uh, media, and the international blockchain community. And today I'm here with Elja Boom from Oxy, uh, and we're going to speak about Oxy, about the market, and about yourself as well. Uh, so uh, first of all, can you please tell me a little bit about the projects and what you brought here to the blockchain economy? Um, our project is unique. Uh, it's called Oxy. It's the first non-considerable wallet, the same as MetaMask Trust Wallet, with Visa. So it's your keys, your crypto. And you do only KYC for the Visa part, because you need to as well follow the regulations. And so let's say for an example, you use your Visa and the money is coming from money laundry or Ponzi scheme, the Visa will stop. But the access to your fund, no one has it. It's your keys, your crypto. And for the first time in history, we are in the crypto history, we are in more than 170 countries, they can apply for it. And we have Apple Pay and Samsung Pay, where you get it, if you did your KYC, and it got passed by our KYC partners, you're gonna get the card within seven hours or something, and then you can put it your Apple Pay, your Google Pay, your Samsung Pay, and enjoy for more than 60 million missions. But amazing. Uh, the question is like, with, with a service like this, with a product like this, uh, who do you think is your main customer? Because like from my perspective, it's people who make money in crypto and uh, want to spend it, but they don't want to use uh, exchanges and stuff like that. I've been in this space for more than nine years. Okay. And when we came, me and Tobias, which is the founder and the co-founder, we said, let's solve something that will stand for the future. We don't want to just build something that it will just stay for one year. So what is the future? The future is for people to use the crypto and for even attract the Web2 people to come in. Because why would I come in if I'm a Web2 guy living in Asia, living in the Middle East, living in Africa, or even in Europe and US, but I don't know how to take my crypto in a normal way. Because if I'm not using my crypto today, as a way, I'm gonna go now. Can I can go? I can go with my crypto right away. Using, for an example, BNB. I can go right now, buy you whatever a drink, and pay right away with my BNB. And that's adoption. So we solve the future problem in mass adoption, but we have it today live. So, kind of the main idea is to uh, make crypto a payment method uh, that people can use uh, right away uh, with a simple KYC. As uh, uh, somebody told me in Oxy, uh, it tells around like uh, 10 to 15 minutes uh, to proceed the KYC and it's exactly. like super fast. And basically you have crypto, uh, you, you, you have the right citizenship or right nationality. And you have your keys. And you have no, your keys. If, if me and uh, the founder, one day we, we need money, we're gonna announce bankruptcy. We cannot take your funds. This is a non-custodial wallet. Exactly. But like, as the part that is connected with Visa non-custodial as well? The Visa, you have a button for the wallet. Okay. You move your funds from the wallet to the card, and then you top up your Visa and use it. Okay. So the fund is yours. Okay, amazing, man. Uh, so uh, how long have you been in business? Uh, for how long are you developing the product? For how long have you lasted? Uh, we were working offline. It means we didn't raise any fund. We did it, me and Tobias, from our own fund, from our technical team, from the legality, from opening companies, from auditing, from everything, a year and a half. Our technology, we are a technology provider. Our technology is the innovation part. That's why we have a copyright. It means you cannot use me for a commercial use. Non-commercial is fine. Commercial you cannot. Either you white label or you integrate your blockchain or your token with us. Okay, uh, sounds super cool. Uh, so, uh, who are your competitors and uh, what makes you different? Because as I understand, like Crypto.com, for example, has... Uh, is it working? Uh, so, uh, who are your competitors and what is the difference between you and your... Yeah, yeah. So, who are your competitors and what makes the difference between you and your competitors? I believe we don't have any competitors because we are decentralized. There is none in the market, none considerable. Everyone is centralized. Uh, the, we have Apple Pay and Google Pay. Okay. The majority they still have a card, but I don't see that we are competing with anyone. I see we are supporting everyone. We are a part of everyone. There are other card providers. They are operating in Europe and US. 
we are operating in 170 countries. And uh, at the end, we complete each other. Still, you got to find some people, they only want centralized. They feel more secure because they don't know how to use the decentralized world. You're still going to find some people, they want the decentralized because they feel it's their keys, their crypto. And you still have people for both. They want something here, something there. So kind of the main difference between Oxy and like Crypto.com uh, with their card is that your solution is decentralized and that it's available in 170 countries. And plus we can have as much as blockchains we can support, as much as community and projects, as long as they fit our requirements, they can pay. It's not about uh, six different tokens that they can pay with. We're going to have at some point maybe 50 tokens, no problem. As long as they meet the requirements, they can be in. So let's say you invest in X project, and that project meet the requirements, you can right away pay, pay with the token of this project. Yeah, rather than switching it to stablecoin. But that's super cool. And so who's the, provi who's the provider of liquidity uh, in this case? Are you getting liquidity everything from exchanges? Is, everything is on-chain. So it's happening on PancakeSwap. So the project has to have a minimum $300,000 of liquidity on Pancake, the project themselves, because everything happening on-chain. They sell it on spot, no hidden fees, zero hidden fees. Everything in the blockchain. So the question that I would like to ask you then, uh, how do you make money? Of course, we have many sources. Uh, mainly we have a subscription fee, $6.99 a month. And if you pay with Oxy, you take 10% discount. So that's the utility for Oxy as well. Number two is uh, basically uh, there is, when you top up your card, you pay 2.5%. But mostly it's going for the FX rates because let's say you're in Ukraine, let's say you're in UAE, in a different country, that you're going to pay with their currency. There is an FX rate from dollar, so that will be taken for that. And of course the token, we have it. And of course the company equity at some point, I don't want to say. So coming back to the subscription, uh, with a subscription, so basically to use the wallet you have to pay six, uh, $6.99, which is the same as other providers without mentioning name, they're taking the same amount. But with uh, Oxy, you're taking 10% discount. Okay. Can you please repeat the last phrase? Uh, uh, what did I say? We were going. Uh, uh, ah, okay. About this, coming back to the subscription. Uh, so to use the wallet, you have to pay $6.9 a month, right? Yes. And uh, the same as other providers, the same. As Oxy, you pay 10% discount, which is a very fair price because we don't take anything from the spreadsheets. We don't tell you, hey, listen, we don't take any fee, but it's happening in a spreadsheet because we don't have a spreadsheet. It's happening on spot on PancakeSwap. If you're using, for an example, uh, Phantom, which we support as well as Visa, uh, it takes from uh, Trader Zhao, which is the largest DEX over there. So we have no money coming from there. It's everything you're paying the exact amount. Okay, so, so, sounds very cool. Uh, what is your main object, objective here at this conference? To be a part of the Web3, to come and show people, because the main difficulty we've seen so far, because I'm an, an OG myself, and people are watching my tweets, when I meet them in person, they say, yeah, we see you tweeting about it a lot. Is it really working? You know when it's something too good to be true? So they don't even, they think like it's a promotion, something can happen maybe after five years or something. And I'm just showing a demo, but it's actually working. Uh, first of all, when I heard about the project that you can like with a KYC and with a non custodial wallet, just make a card like in, in, in 15 minutes, I was also thinking that, 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 that probably is something not, not standing right there. And that's like, the biggest problem we're facing today. Everyone I meet, oh my, it's real. Then after I show them and I prove, they do the KYC right away. Maybe you should increase the prices. So <laughs> it would sound yeah, maybe. Uh, more, more, more real. Uh, so how are you fighting the conference? Uh, are you meeting your objectives? What is your favorite part? Uh, of course, I'm, as long as I'm educating one person, uh, I'm getting educated by one person, it means it serves something for me. Because even feedbacks is important. Uh, and seeing it in a conference, it's way easier than someone typing to you in a, in a Web3 where he's texting or he's even sending you a voice messages while he's taking his phone, showing you. It's, it's something serves a lot, right? It makes your time more efficient and you know the result and you know the issue to help it. Yeah, that, that, that sounds amazing. Uh, so if, if we, like right now, as I said, you launch the application, uh, you're getting more and more users. Uh, so uh, how do you see the future of the company in the next three to six months? My dream? 
that this will become a multi-billion dollar company. Because if we looked at the who exists already, and they only serve in few countries, they're already multi-billion dollar companies. But I don't care. I care about today. If I'm serving today, I'm working for today, I'm making some people happy. I can even show you my phone in Arabic language after. Someone told me, you solved a big problem in my life. Not even in his life, because he's using P2P, taking fiat, doesn't know what to do with the cash. Why? You can do it in a legal way, in a more easy way, and we are attracting more people to do it. And that's the main goal. Our main goal, Bitcoin was made to give freedom to people, but not to support bad actors. Here, we are serving exact purpose. Give the freedom for everyone, from every nationality, almost. And because some can, because we are doing, we have regulatory, some yeah, countries are, are prohibited, which is very few and very limited. That's why we are 170 country plus. But keeping everything in the legal term. So if you're having your investment and you make good money, you want to spend it in the normal way, come off. Yeah, man, that, that's that's purely amazing. A question for you as a person. Uh, I'm who, single. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so uh, it's about a company. Uh, so the, the question uh, is pretty simple, and I think it worries a lot of people who come to Dubai. Will it be possible to write down checks? Uh, off, uh, we don't support fiat. Fiat is not. We only crypto. You can use your visa. But uh, there is a good news happening that Apple announced. Uh, I saw it. I saw uh, an article that some of the ATMs you can actually put. Tap up your, up your uh, Apple Pay and you withdraw cash. Uh, and I'm not, not really speaking about that. Like, for example, if, if you're a crypto person, uh, yes. you live in Dubai, uh, and uh, you don't want to have a bank account, for example, with a normal bank, uh, and you want to pay for your rent. Uh, in Dubai, you can pay for you your rent only in one way, uh, have, with checks. Yes. No, here, why? You have your Apple Pay, you pay, you have up to $50,000, and every blockchain we support Visa a day. Okay. So at the moment we have four blockchains with yeah. Visa. You can spend a day up to two hundred thousand dollar. That's amazing. Okay. If you want more, um, no, it means I cannot sell before today. <laughs> I have to be honest. But the people, I think, people who want more is a pretty small market. Yeah. Uh, not many people. I'm looking more. for the community, the normal people. Yeah, the normal people, obviously. Uh, so, uh, can you please tell about what is your website? Uh, what is your social media? How can people find you? It's uh, OKSE.io, and you can find the website, you can find everything, and me, El Jaboum, E L J A B W O M. Okay, amazing. So, OKSE.io and El Jaboum. Uh, I hope you find it, guys. Uh, so, thank you so much. It was uh, the Washington Elites. I'm very happy to thank speak here much. with you, El Jaboum. Thank you uh, for having me, and thank you for standing. She's standing all time here. Thank you very much. <laughs> Uh, yeah, one sec. Let's shake hands.